hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is all about korean skincare if you are someone that struggles with tired looking skin dull looking skin texture or an uneven skin tone these products are for you i've used korean skincare before but i used it on my legs when i was trying to get rid of my strawberry skin and ever since then i've not used anything else for my strawberry skin so i was like do you know what i want to try this on my face i want to see what happens because for me when i try out new products on my face it goes goes two ways it can either be absolutely fantastic or literally the worst mistake of my life it's always like a very risky thing to do but this has worked wonders for my skin as you guys may or may not see i mean for me i absolutely love it a lot of people have been dealing with me and asking me what have i changed in my skin what have i added what have i taken out what have i substitute what have i done and this video is all about that it's all about what i have changed and what i have changed is I've stopped using all other skincare products and I've been using Korean skincare. Now, Korean skincare has been in the hype, it's been in the trending for a while now, but I had not really seen Korean skincare products on people of color so i was very very skeptical to try this on my skin i can't lie to you so as always i did my research and i found this brand called be the skin this is their packaging and i've been using their products for a few weeks now i'm going to be reviewing four of their products so you've got the cleanser this is the cleansing foam and then you've got the toner this is the pore zero toner and then you've got the dark spot cream and you've got the pore zero bha serum these are the products that i'm going to be reviewing and showing you guys how to use let's jump right into the first product which is the cleansing foam the packaging is good everything is simple it's just there there's no like complicated writing or anything nothing too messy it's just clean and this has willow bark in it willow bark is basically a natural exfoliant it's a natural bha so instead of salicylic acid in it it's basically a substitute for that so on their packaging they do say tight feeling zero blackhead zero pore zero waste zero bubble up and i think that sums up this product really really well for me when i wash my face it don't feel tight after a lot of cleansers especially like foaming cleansers they can make your skin look so dry dry after it's got glycerin in it so it will retain that moisture which is good so basically i apply this onto wet hands and a wet face because it's a foaming cleanser so you need it to foam up so you want to lather up the product in your hands nicely okay so i've got water in front of me that's how i'm going to do it and then you're going to place the product into the palms of your hands like so um and the good thing with these products is a little goes a long way you don't need a lot literally guys and then you lather it into your hands like so so this is how it looks it's nice and foamy so you apply it onto your skin and you rub in circular motions for like two to three minutes depending on how you usually wash your face but for me i wash my face for like two to three minutes that's what works for me obviously i do it like this you guys because i'm in front of my desk but usually when i'm washing my face i'm literally like this so don't get it twisted i'm gonna go rinse my face off now because it's getting very very messy and i've just come back from rinsing my face this is how my skin looks so basically i just rinse my skin until it feels dry i use lukewarm water nothing crazy like just literally just rinse your skin guys i don't want to overcomplicate it because i know you guys know how to wash your face but um we don't use towels on our face to dry our skin around here we air dry so that's what i'm doing i'm just air drying my skin So next up is the toner. This is good stuff, you guys. This will be your second step of exfoliation. This has no fragrance in it. You're not going to react. So toner next. I'm going to show you how I use it before I get into the ingredients and all of that. Basically, I literally apply a little bit onto my palms like so. Like nothing crazy, literally just a few drops and then I tap it into my skin. And the reason why I do this is because when I use a cotton pad, sometimes I feel like I over apply. And when you over apply products, you can actually make your skin a little bit sensitive. So you just want to do stuff that works for your skin because they recommend using a cotton pad. But I've always applied toner like this, if I'm honest. Um, yeah, and it's just less wasteful in my opinion this toner guys believe it or not i've been using it for a few weeks now and look where it's at 
it's very very good because a little goes a long way i expect to get to the end of this bottle by possibly next year because it does last a long time so this is very very good again it's got willow bark in it so it's going to be your second step of exfoliation like i said to you guys a big key factor of korean skincare products is exfoliation you are exfoliating your skin you're getting rid of the dead skin cells you're shedding all that dead skin cells so therefore you're revealing smoother skin that is all all there is to it that is all there is to that donut glazed look that they will talk about that is it it's exfoliation and hydration just that next up we've got the serum this serum is probably my favorite part i feel like every part i've been saying is my favorite part but this is good like i really like using this serum you guys for so many different reasons i'm gonna break it down for you when i apply it i'm gonna show you just how i apply it first you want to apply it as far away from your skin as possible basically you just want to apply it like so onto your skin as you can see the pipette did not touch my skin um it can be a bit messy when you're trying to apply it from up here but it's worth it because when the pipette touches your skin it's going to contaminate the product so i just apply it onto my skin like so you want to be very gentle you don't want to do no rubbing um you just want to be gentle with it um sometimes i do pat it into my skin like so so let's talk key ingredients key ingredient again is willow bark we have that willow bark in all these products because we need to continue to exfoliate our skin throughout each product however they also have chlorophyll in it and chlorophyll is basically derived from green plants i actually drink chlorophyll when i saw it in the ingredient list i was like oh my goodness i did not know that you can apply it onto your skin because i have seen some people put chlorophyll onto your skin i drink it because it clears my body from inside and then also it shows on the outside so chlorophyll is good for clearing out your skin like drinking it so this one actually says pour zero check blackhead zero sebum zero comedo zero and moisture up this is how they basically summarize what each product does and i can definitely testify that it does do that it does control my oil production i feel that my skin is not oily when i apply this product it keeps it in control and is non-comedogenic so it's very good for sensitive skin it's good for acne prone skin so i definitely recommend getting yourself some of this last step is a dark spot cream so this is the last step you guys let me show you how i put it on my skin before i talk about it it's got a very nice interesting applicator like so i apply it onto my fingers i do like a three finger method just because i like a lot of moisture on my face and that's it that's how i apply the moisturizer onto my skin and as you guys can see it gives my skin a nice glow so this dust spot cream is great for so many different things it's got glycolic toner in it and if you guys may or may not know i use glycolic toner when i am struggling with hyperpigmentation when i saw it in the cream i was ecstatic because it's good for lightening the hyperpigmentation so when it says gets rid of blemishes dark marks uh, wrinkles and stuff like that is because of the glycolic toner because that does do it not only does it have that it also has niacinamide in it and niacinamide for me was my go-to product from the ordinary but now because it's got this in it i find myself not having to use any of those products because it's got everything in it so like these products have a little bit of everything so everything that i have used before are in these products which to me is like fantastic that's why it was super easy for me to switch to these products because everything that i have ever used is in them everything that i love is in them and i like natural ingredients my skin works well with natural ingredients this has been fantastic so this one says dark spot zero blackhead zero whitehead zero cherry spot zero whitening up so that is a nice little summary there it's showing that all the dark spots like for me i've got these dark spots here but they have been fading that's why you can't really see them and it's because of this dark spot cream so you guys 
if you take anything from this video get yourself some korean skincare products this brand is great it's great as a beginner friendly brand because it's got everything that you need in them everything that i've ever basically talked about is in these products so it's a very good starting base it's not too much of everything it's a little bit of everything that you need to get smooth skin so take my advice live a better life i will have the products linked in my bio in my description it's gonna have the prices it's gonna have the links it's gonna have very clear instructions on how to use them as well thank you guys so much for watching my video i hope you've enjoyed it i've really enjoyed filming it and using these products thank you also be the skin for sending me these products i mean let's not forget about that so have a great fantastic day you guys and i will catch you on my next video bye